All right, so we are out here at 1494 Song Street. Um, and it's just in the quiet little part of Port Charlotte where it's pretty standard, just uh, non-deed restricted, no HOA, none of that. It's just houses. Um, and you can see they're redoing the roof. And this is, to let me talk about it briefly, my exact fear with... Um, so you guys are closing on your property. These ones that are not FHA approved or the roof is older. This one was under contract. It was going to be sold in the VA. Um, and then their contract fell through most likely because the roof did not pass the inspection. And then I'm assuming they bought something else or it just fell apart in general. Um, but this thing already went through appraisal and it appraised at 315. Um, so quite literally, they're going to get that. And then some, if this roof finishes, I would suggest if you like what you see here, um, I'll talk to this list agent quite literally today and maybe we could get a deal, but this thing is crazy inside. I mean, it's the most polished product I think I've shown you guys. Um, so you'll see it's tile throughout and it's all new, good condition. It's not brand new, but coat closet over here. And I couldn't get any of these lights to come on. Um, all their ceiling fan lights, I was pulling the string to get them to come on. And I was, I was just changing stuff. So I figured I'd stop. Um, but so around the corner here, you've got your shower closet with all your linens and stuff. And then it's just a two bed, two bath. It's not split floor plan, but I think this could be perfect for, uh, if you got some young ones in the future running around, it's right next to the bedroom. You can see they've got their little one stuff, um, bedroom, wooden planking. Yeah, it's pretty big in here. TV mounted, all that jazz. And I turned the lights on everywhere, so. But, take you in. So front door is right around the corner. Bathroom, master's right here. And I didn't actually open up their closet. So they've got some built-in shelving. I think it would all stay, hopefully. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, they got all kinds of stuff. And I thought it was weird. It's the middle of a work day, and I was able to show this house even though all their stuff is there. It's like, wow. So master bath. This is pretty much the same layout as my house. So master, master bath, and then it kind of falls down into the tile shower, which is all nice and cleaned up. Can lights up top. Toilet, vanity's all really new. There's me today. Hello. Um, yeah, this thing looks probably not brand new, but pretty close to it. Mirror and fixture are also in good condition. Um, this is pretty nice. You've got multiple layers to it. They got their little scale, but that won't stay. Hit that light. Some type of PA system. I don't know what that is, but looks like they were in the process of replacing their air filter. Very nice. Second bathroom. Definitely the old vanity. Still a nice mirror. The lights are a little bit dated, but they look okay. Storage built in. And then we've got a tub shower. So, and this is the original tiling, I would assume. I'm um, still in good condition, just not very modern. And then this is obviously older, but it's still cleaned up. So, but we'll take you on through the living room. So it kind of vaults up. And then you've got space here where you can see out your front yard, all that stuff. And then you've got dining space, kitchen. And the wood inside the kitchen is all very high quality. I don't think it's soft clothes. Maybe. Oh, they are. Wow, check that out. Let me make sure I'm not crazy. Eh, kinda. They have stoppers. I was gonna say, these feel like they're stop clothes or soft clothes. I gotta push it harder than that. Yep, okay. So that's soft clothes. Um, not a brand new sink, but solid surface countertops. These are nice too. And then we'll join the pile over here. So a couple people have been coming and going. Um, fridge over there, more storage. Not sure where the pantry would be. Let's see. So I'm not seeing a pantry per se, but there's plenty of cabinets. So unless maybe this is supposed to be the pantry. No. Then what do they use for the pantry? Is it this? Okay. But they just have storage stuff inside. But I'm assuming that's what that's supposed to be. Garage is off to this side. And it's actually got that, um, I don't know what I'd call it, some type of enamel where it's oil-based with the spackle for texture. And they're in the process of moving out. Washer and dryer there. Wash sink, electric, AC. 
Um, and then it's just a one car garage, so nothing crazy. Um, but let's come on out here. And they've got this either extra crib room or whatever. These, Heidi just got one. I kid you not, Heidi paid like $400 for like some type of moon bag. And these things, I, I don't know. I just, I, I couldn't see myself paying that much for such a, an abstract chair. It's crazy. Looks like one of their paintings fell. Um, but this is pretty much as good as a, a Florida room can get. It's under air. Um, I love it. Take you out here. Looks like they've got pavers for the pool. And you can even see the neighbor's grotto. Look at that. Can I zoom in on some of that? So they've got grottos and rocks. Palm trees inside. Look at their yard, too. Wow, so that's the neighbor's house. And yours, you've got room for dogs, actually, out here and everything. The pool is in good condition. Oh, I'm not zoomed out far enough. And it's pavers everywhere. And then more space over here. Um, so... Like I said, I think this thing's only on the market again just because the, the VA stuff fell through. I don't know how much longer this one would be listed. I don't know if it just came back on market or what. I'll have to look at some of the price history. Um, but this one's a really nice house. I wish I could have wiped my feet off somewhere because it's wet outside. But um, keep me posted on what you're thinking. Um, it's not huge. It's literally like a little less than 1,300 square feet. Two bedrooms off to the side. Kind of an extra bedroom if you really wanted it to be. Um, but to me, this is a pretty perfect uh, first step into Florida. I, I think that it's very cleaned up and polished. Um, let me know what you guys think, and I will talk to you soon. All right, bye.